Good morning, this is Jacob and Marley for Gator News on Friday, January 25th, 2019. Time for a new location. Well, we haven't had any snow around here yet. So let's head somewhere really cold today. Um, Antarctica maybe? Okay, plenty of snow here. Now for the special announcements. Students, please use your best behavior while in the cafeteria today. And teachers, please have your attendance turned in by 9 o'clock. Now for the weather forecast. Today's weather will be partly cloudy and 50 degrees. 50? Ha! Huh. Try 5 degrees out here. Lunch today will be assorted pizza or a fish basket. We have two birthdays today and two over the weekend. Isabella Colson in Miss Sabdo's class, Kamari Gatlin in Miss Williams' class, Jaden Solano in Miss Billington's class, and Jude Sloan in Miss Bowman's fourth grade class. Happy birthday, Isabella, Kamari, Jaden, Jude. Today we are shining the spotlight on our new Gerganus music teacher, Miss Palma Tagus. She was interviewed by Kirsten earlier this week. Take it away, Kirsten. Hello, Miss Palma Tagus. Thank you for coming to our interview today. All of us at Gerganus are excited to learn a little bit about you. So here we go with our first question. How long have you been teaching and have you always taught music? Um, this is my 17th year teaching, so longer than we've been alive. Um, and I've taught music most of those 17 years. I did teach, um, I actually have a degree in Spanish too. So I taught Spanish for the first three years that I was a teacher. What, what made you want to become a music teacher? Um, I always knew I wanted to be a teacher from the time I was in elementary school. I just didn't know what kind of teacher. And when I got to middle school, I think that was when that really, my brain went, yep, this is what I want to do. I want to teach music. What is your favorite part of being a music teacher? Um, getting to see everybody every week and just teaching and seeing the excited faces when we try different things and new things that we haven't done before. What is your favorite type of music? Oh, that's a hard one because I like all kinds of music. Um, when I'm in the car, a lot of times I listen to music by decades. You know, like sometimes I'll listen to music from the 90s or sometimes I'll listen from the 70s. But I even like music from today. I like a little bit of everything. Mm -hmm. Do you play any musical instruments? I do. I play the piano and I play a little bit of guitar. And then, of course, I play the instruments that we play in class, too. Mm -hmm. Okay, switching gears from music for a minute. Mm -hmm. What do you like to do outside of school? Um, outside of school, I like to read. I love to read. Um, and I like to shop. <laughs> and I like to spend time with my family. Do you have any pets? I do. I have a dog. I have a little weenie dog. His name's Oscar. He's 12. Um, he is deaf and blind, so he uh, needs extra special care, which we always love to give to him. So, where is your favorite place to travel? Ooh, I think the beach. I love going to the beach. <laughs> and last but not least, what is your favorite color? Ooh, that's an easy one, actually. My favorite color is blue. Mm. <laughs> well, there you have it, folks. All the details that you need to know about Miss Palomatakis. Thank you for the interview, and thank you for joining our Gator family. Well, thank you so much. I'm really excited. Now for the joke of the day. Where do polar bears keep their money? I don't know. Let me ask one. Hey, polar bears, where do you keep your money? Okay, let's not invite the bears over. The answer is in the snowbank. Last but not least, please stand for the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Have a great day, Gators, and have a fun Friday.